that Americans are returning to their roots that this nation was founded on. Right now we are in the beginning stages of a severe economic downturn and many Americans are facing hardships and strife. But many people are learning this painful and important lesson that the things of this world can easily be taken away and our, self, uh, and our self made riches and stability can be ripped apart. So we as Christians must suit up in our armor to prepare for this fight against this present darkness. That only with our faith in Christ and the power of the price He paid for us at the cross can we defeat this evil hold that has hold of our nation and the world. In my own life, I thank the Lord every day for providing everything that I need, not necessarily everything that I want, and that He has brought my children back to me and that my family is getting closer and closer. And I also thank the Lord for placing me within the Filipino-American Christian Fellowship in my life and that the calling that He has placed in my heart for the Philippines is beginning to take shape with this ministry. Um, that here in Springfield, Missouri. And I pray that the Lord opens doors so that as we as a congregation can help the far off home of the Philippines. And even though times may be hard here in the United States, that we will still be able to do great things for the Lord here and that He will provide for all of our needs so for us to spread the gospel here in the Springfield and then in the Philippines and throughout the world. Um, I guess let's pray. Uh, Lord, I thank you so much for letting us be able to share your gospel and your word today and to be able to be in a place where we have the freedom to speak our mind and to be able to share your love to each other. And I just ask you, Lord, to just help open the eyes of us here in the United States to see that your way is the only way and that we can only trust in you, Lord, and that with you as our, our anchor and as our focus point, that even through these difficult times that nothing will be uh, too hard for you and that all that we will be able to do even greater things for you in this country. I mean, just thank you so much, Lord, for letting us to have this, this night together and uh, just watch over us as we, as we uh, spend the service tonight and uh, guide us in the path that you have for us. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. 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 Amen.